Hey creative friends, it's Linda from Tuli Lou Creates and welcome to my kitchen. Right now, we're in my kitchen, but I'm not going to do a food thing. I'm going to do a very fun thing, and this is going to be how to make a secret in your pantry. I've got some stuff setting aside over here because I'm going to do a canning video in a little bit, but I wanted to show you this really cool way of making a secret in your pantry, and I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. You need a, a clean jar, a roll of toilet paper, a toilet paper roll, and if you want to use the big quart jar, you just need a paper towel roll and you'll need a glue gun and a clothespin or some kind of a clip and beans or whatever kind of thing you want to use and this is so simple I'm going to show you what I'm doing here I'm going to take this uh, roll of toilet paper this toilet paper roll and I'm going to squeeze the top of it and I'm going to put this clip on it to hold it shut and I'll show you why in a minute and then I'm going to take my glue gun and I'm going to go around the base of this toilet paper roll and I'm just going to put a lot of glue on there because you want it to be pretty secure. And then I'm going to take it down in the jar, kind of in the center. And it might be a little bit bigger than the mouth of the jar, so you're just going to have to squeeze it in there, and that's fine. So I'm going to push it down in there. See how it's attaching itself to the bottom? That's fine. This doesn't take time at all. And you can take the clip off and kind of pull on it and see it's already hooked on there, which is awesome. But I'm going to put the clip back on because I want the top of that jar, this uh, little uh, hold, this little paper towel, or toilet paper hole, roll, <laughs> the toilet paper roll to be sealed shut. And then I'm going to put my funnel on the top of it just like if I'm filling it for canning. And I'm going to take something like beans or rice or anything. And there it is. I'm going to fill this guy up. Let me just. You could use rice, you could use beans, and if you really want it to look good, you could actually squeeze a little bit of um, the glue gun in there around those beans and uh, kind of make it look a little bit better if you want. Okay, so I'm not going to fill it all the all the way top, so you got to have a little bit of room. You want to shake that around a little bit, maybe move some over so they're even, and then you take the clip off. And then you just kind of put your fingers in there, shake it around, and you can open that toilet paper holder up again. Oh, you can't see that. So see there? Look at there. Look at the side of that jar. So I've got some awesome stuff. I've got some, some movie money. Let's just pretend that's fake movie money, but pretend that's real money. Pretend maybe you got a special key. Where'd my key go? I lost my key. Anyway, I had a little key. Maybe a combination to a safe you could put in there. You can put all that in there. And I had a key that was like a safe box key. Oh, there it is. Maybe a secret key. And then put the lid on it. Looky there. Put it on your pantry. And you'll know what this jar is. But anybody that maybe goes in your house would not know. And there you go. You can put in a lot of stuff. So why not, why not make a little secret for your pantry? It only takes a couple seconds. Look at there. I did that in less than five minutes. And you can make a bunch of these. And just put them around. But see? Check it out. Okay? Fun stuff. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you like and subscribe. And this was fun. Now I'm going to get to some serious canning over here. I'm going to make some grapefruit marmalade. Yum. Thanks for watching.